From Commodity Classic 2016 in New Orleans, I'm the fabulous farm babe Pam Yankee. You know, one of the things that BASF prides itself on is making sure that they are encouraging the next generation of farmers. And I'll tell you, one young lady that impressed me as a previous winner of the BASF scholarship with the National Wheat Growers is uh, Morgan Perez from uh, out by Washington State. Tell me a little bit about yourself, Morgan. Yes, um, I grew up in eastern Washington on a small uh, dry land wheat. Yep. And, um, you know, it amazes me to this day that we can grow anything on <laughs> seven inches of rain. Yep. But, um, you know, I grew up showing pigs and yep. doing wheat harvest every year since I was ever brought into this sure. life. And, sure. um, you know, I didn't really realize it was anything. And I went away to college and I did not go to college for our culture. I went to um, school for pre-med. I wanted to be a doctor, an anesthesiologist to be exact, and um, I just was intrigued in the medical. I love helping people, and you know, I, I guess as a whole, I never really thought I would help people doing farming or whatever, because I grew up in a town with 500 people, you know, I didn't communicate with too many people, you knew everybody, and so I wanted something different. I wanted to be in the big city and be this great life. And, you know, I just realizing how non-connected the medical school was, how it was always argumentative and honestly, the ethics I did not part with, um, you know, and that was a real change in my life. And I, my advisor, I, my future advisor I met and, you know, he instantly changed my mind and not did he just change my mind he brought out my passion he right. made me slapped it on my head and said you know hey what look at this what are you doing you know talk talk to me a little bit more about that because sometimes we forget how one person can really make a big difference in yeah. somebody else's life how did that conversation help was he new to you did you meet at a club i, I mean you know like a yeah. egg club or um, he was brand new to me. Um, I never went to the trap shoots. You know, I was very non-connected yeah. in the agricultural industry whatsoever at school. And, you know, all of the kids I grew up with were in the agricultural major. And I was like, oh my gosh, I see how happy they are. I see what they're doing. And I want to be like them. Like, And so they sent me to the guy to talk to. And instantly connected with him and you know I think there's a thing where you can connect you feel when you connect with someone and they mean so much to you and he was so personable that he asked me about me it wasn't just get me in get me out it was talk to me about your life what are you interested in why you know what do you see in our culture you know and you know it wasn't about why are you here it was what's your life been yeah. and you know telling him my story brought out you know my passion and you know I thank him all the time and he shrugs it like it's nothing sure. but you know he is like that I mean every kid that has gone through that program has, he's made a difference in his life speaking of making a difference so you are a previous BASF scholarship award winner and you said that too kind of helped to fuel that change it did. I, you know, I was in limbo uh, during that year when I applied for the scholarship. You know, I saw it on the table at dinner, and I was like, no, I don't think so. And deadline was next week, and then I made the deadline miraculously. And, you know, I, I got it, and I, you know, I never win anything. And so I'm like, oh, my God, this is groundbreaking. And so, you know, I won. And it was such a limbo in my life that it hit perfectly where it was like a hook and sinker, you know, like, I mean, just being here, it's just a great, friendly environment. Everybody wants to talk, you yep. know, like you get to hear from states away what yep. kind of farming they're doing there. Yep. I mean, yep. it's so diverse that you could do egg business. You can do, you could be out there in the field if you want. You can do the chemical side. You could do the marketing side. I mean, just because you, I mean, I thought I only had to be an operator, you know, I'm yeah. like, that is so boring. But, you know, still to this day, I still love drive combines, so... <laughs> You're not done being yeah. made. That operator stuff, they're all yeah. operators around us today, yeah. Morgan, that's for sure. Where are you channeling your energy, your passion right now? Right now, I am a crop advisor in the Columbia Basin. Um, we have irrigation there, yep. um, lots of circles, yep. um, lots of different crops, yeah. and lots of problems, um, you know, from Mother Nature to just resistance. Yes. Um, I sell just for fertilizer, and it's not just selling a product. It's 
also selling yourself in in relationships. You know, I've learned a lot about communication and pers personalities. I mean, it's been. I mean, I'm the only girl that I know that works in the industry down there, and um, it was hard for me the first year because I was the only girl. I didn't think I was getting taken seriously, but this is my third year, and they trust me with all of their money, their entire crops, and I'm like, oh my gosh, you know, it's it's such a compliment, Absolutely. and I feel like every day I make a difference in their lives and in this whole entire industry. Well, you are a wonderful story that speaks volumes about what not just a, the BASF scholarship can do for a person, but that one person that takes the time. Morgan Perez, congratulations. Thank you very much. Morgan Perez, again, from Eastern Washington State, one of the previous scholarship award winners here at Commodity Classic, sharing her story at the BASF National Wheat Growers Association booth. I'm Farm Director Pam Yonke.